Oh, January. As a futurist, I get a lot of questions about what to expect when we have a brand new year ahead of us. But what if I told you that's the wrong question to ask? And what if I told you there is a really good question, a question you and your team should think about? Think about it like this. January, as you know, is the most lucrative month for fitness centers. But you also know that doesn't mean we can expect people all around us to be more fit in the end of this year. So why not? Well, after January comes February and then comes March. And by the end of March, 90%, 9 out of 10 of all the people have quit the gym after three months only. They're gone. The only thing left is that Instagram post from, from January. New year, new me. So what I'm trying to tell you is that instead of asking what the future will be like, you should ask yourself questions about your action. First question, will you, can you focus on action instead of reaction? Nothing wrong with reaction. Last year was, was all about reaction and in critical situations, of course you need to react to survive to cut costs and stuff like that. But a first aid kit, um, a fire extinguisher, those are not the tools you need for, for a regular work day unless you work as a first responder. In a time defined by an increased speed of change, you need to ask yourself how to minimize the reactive work you have to do to maximize time and resources for proactive work, action. If you want to change results, you need to change your action. You know that. So again, don't think too much about what we can expect from this new year. Think about your action from now on. How can you and your team make sure you're not going to be part of the 90% to quit doing? If you just manage that, if you just manage to show up, to stay, to ship, this year will mark a spectacular breakthrough. Okay, so how do you do that? I mean, it sounds easy, but, but again, 90%. It's not because people forget. So let me just give you one piece of advice. Keep it simple. You know the old saying, complexity is the enemy of execution. So that should mean we all try to keep it simple, huh? Mm -mm. Just have a look at those uh, PowerPoint slides you carry around. Your corporate strategy, your core values, words, words, graphs, uh, stock photographs, more words. If you want action, you need to keep it simple. Why do you think advertising is simple? Uh, media, political campaigns, one sentence, one word only. Okay, you want to lose weight this year? As a futurist, I have one word for you. Run! Run!